Hello everyone and welcome to the first part of my adventures in Fallout New Vegas. I haven't really played any of the other Fallout games, so this is going to be a bright new experience for me. I um, hope you guys will join me all the way, and feel free to just subscribe if you like the video. Yeah, let's do this. Pretty impressive audio here. Okay. Well, that's that's nice, I guess. changes. When atomic fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic, dedicated to old world values of democracy. That was and a terrible law. flag. Look As the Republic shit. grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam, just barely, against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business, under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier, hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. You're awake. How about that? Whoa, easy there, easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Um, thank you. Welcome to Good Springs. Thank you. Now, I hope you don't mind, but I had to go rooting around there in your noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework, but you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. How am I supposed to know? I can't look How'd down. Do? <laughs> you did horrible. What's wrong with that shin? I'm obviously female. Oh god, no. I'm obviously male. <clears throat> Race. I'm obviously Asian. <laughs> yes, it's going to tilt upwards like that. To make me extra cute. And yes, it's going to go inside my body a little bit like that. Blue tint, why? Yellow tint, um, <laughs> I wouldn't need much more of that, would I? Um, 
eye sockets. They're gonna be pale, very pale. My lips are gonna be bright. My mustache is going to be brighter. Beautiful I am with my mustache. Perfect. I'm gonna find the most mangy like haircut. That's pretty close. Yep, that's it. I'm done. Yes, I really well, do. I got most of it right anyway. Stuff that mattered. Yeah, like my okay. yellowness. No sense keeping you in bed anymore. Yay. Let's see if we can get you on your feet. Please tell me I didn't have to get rid of my Good. Ooh, I can look around. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Mm. Over by that bigger tester machine there. Bigger? Take it slow now. It ain't a race. Did I download Bioshock? Oh, I can zoom out. <laughs> I'm wearing underwear. Look at me. That's a stiff way to move. <laughs> you can't keep a good cowboy down. Not if he's the enduring type. And not if he's got a six shooter the size of all tarnation. What do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through a couple of questions? See if your dogs are still barking. <laughs> sure. I don't see why we have to do all this, you know, psychology shit, but, um... I guess I'll just like lie down on this couch here with my underwear. Not that you could give me pants or anything, but I am All an Asian. Right. I'm gonna say a word. I want you to say the first thing that comes to mind. That's pretty scary, Dog. but okay. Dog, uh, bark, cat, uh, feed, newspaper, train, kick, kick. Really? Uh, dinner? <laughs> dinner, of course. I'm a fucking Asian. House. <laughs> um, I guess I wanna... <clears throat> Target the house. Night. Sleep, please. Bandit. Um, vaporize. Well, I know all bandits are reasonable. Light. Um. <clears throat> Inspiration. Mother. Mother. <laughs> Cookie art. Tell me what you see. I actually see like the tip of a penis. There might be something wrong with me, but. Hmm. Can't answer that, so. Okay. How about this one? And that's definitely the counterpart. I'm too embarrassed to say what it looks like. Last one. Um. I think we've gone further inside now. So I guess we're in the, like, uterus thing. So it's basically a light and darkness. Or a bearded man. <laughs> Depends on how you see things. I'm gonna go for a bearded man. All right. I guess that about does it. Thanks. Come Can with I me. I'll please leave now. Can I stand up? Some way. It's a camera. Here's a pre-war book. Here's a small ruin book. Here's a small. Do I have to? But I guess I have to because I'm such a hardcore player, or something like that. Ain't that a kick in the head? Um. Great. Let's head out into the world. Woo! Look at that view. That's pretty non-attractive. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. We'll be back with part two some other time. Yeah. <laughs> Bye.